December. So remember. And we thank you guys you for making this happen. You can get anything you sent This is your parade. Mm. You guys are the stars of the show. Chips, singing carols with the click and a rack of wind. Hey everyone, it's Kyan. Today is my birthday, and I am here in Las Vegas, Nevada at our Vegas house, and today it is my 16th birthday. This birthday is gonna be a little bit different than years past because, well, I'm not gonna be seeing any friends. It's just gonna be a casual day with uh, some of my family. Right now it's about 4 p.m., and I'm starting the video much later than I had anticipated originally because I didn't wanna film much of our close family time earlier in the day. Um, I just kind of want to start this video a little bit later and um, this video is going to be much shorter, a little bit more condensed than some years past because, well, we're just doing less. And ironically, it's like the biggest birthday when you're a kid, 16. So that part is a little bit a little bit unfortunate that it's this birthday during the quarantine, but we're still gonna make it fun. We're gonna have uh, we're gonna have some fun throughout the day here in Las Vegas. Earlier today, we had some family time. Like for example, Nick and Lindsay came over. They hung out for a little while as I opened some gifts and as we had some cake and stuff like that earlier in the day, um, around 1 p.m. And then also I skyped with some of my grandparents. So. It's been a relatively casual day, but we've also been doing a decent amount of stuff. This morning, for example, well, we did some Christmas thing that my mom signed us up for. We kind of just, it was like a drive-through Christmas float experience. It was uh, interesting. Then later in the day, um, like three hours ago, we had some cake and stuff like I was talking about at the beginning of this video, and I recorded a bit, so here's some of that footage. Now that you've seen some of the footage of what's happened up till this point in the day, now you're ready to continue on past this point. All right, so now we are actually going to my birthday dinner. We are going to Benihana, which is a pretty cool restaurant that we've been to a few times before, and even a couple of times in some of my vlogs that I didn't even post. You'll probably see those videos in the future. Um, anyway, for now we're gonna go to Benihana for my birthday dinner. That's where we're going now. And uh, I'm gonna bring this camera and uh, a pocket-sized Sony camera as well, the RX100, and let's have some fun. And that's pretty much it. It's been a pretty casual birthday, and um, and while it's been casual, it has been fun. Now I'm gonna go inside, gather a couple of my things, and now we're gonna go to dinner. Big one. 
tin Okay, we have now left Benihana. Great dinner, got a huge variety of food. All of the food was great. And now we are just walking here around the strip. And pretty soon we're gonna be heading to the escape room. All right, now we're gonna go in, do the escape room. That's gonna be about an hour, and I'll see you guys after the escape room. Hey, yo, it is the next day. Uh, I'm at the house um, <laughs> last night after the escape room, and with it being extremely late, um, I didn't film anymore. Uh, I apologize for kind of just dropping it off and not filming anymore after that point last night. However, I am here now to give you an update and let you know what happened last night after I didn't film anymore. Or not much more. I did get a little bit of footage and you'll see that in a second. Last night after we arrived at the escape room, we then went in and had a good time. I've done escape rooms before, however, the last one I did was about three years ago. So clearly it had been a while. Um, and also with me just recovering from COVID a couple of weeks ago and my symptoms lingering a little bit, uh, my mind was a little bit foggy, so that didn't help much. But in the end, despite my foggy brain and us being in the escape room and not being able to film, we did have a lot of fun and we finished the escape room, which had three rooms, I think, the one that we did. Um, we finished it within exactly one hour and we had stopwatches on our on our arms so we knew like how long exactly it had been since we walked right into the room and we had I believe two seconds to spare right when we detonated a bomb um, so that's how that went and after that then we said goodbye to Nick and Lindsay and we headed to the strip and on the strip last night we walked around hung out enjoyed the scene even though sometimes you see some stuff that you don't want to see we did have some fun we went and looked for the monolith that weird like stone steel thing that just like kind of appears out of the ground like some people have been reporting these strange little I don't, I don't know they're actually kind of massive from the pictures I've seen these strange like I don't even know what they are, but they are very weird. And apparently, there was one on the strip, kind of like at the like one of the one of the ends of the strip. So we tried to go track it down, and in fact, we actually did find where it was, even though that one had already disappeared. We tried to talk to some people, and not many people actually knew anything. So that was kind of how far that went. Now I'm going to show you some footage of what happened. So on our way home, we <laughs> on our way home we have stopped. Uh, right now we're in some random casino, and uh, we're trying to find the monolith. We don't know if we're gonna find it, but we're at least gonna try.
And then after that, then, well, we went home. That was that was pretty much it. We just drove around, had some fun. I filmed a little bit on my, on my camera of the Las Vegas skyline of some of the casinos on the Strip, so you can see some of that footage now. And after that, we went home. We came back here. That was that was it for the night. So in the end, it was just a really casual birthday. And while we did some fun stuff, it was much more casual than what we've done in years past. But it was still a really fun birthday. And despite me not getting to see any friends this year, because, well, one, we're in Nevada, and we know significantly fewer people here than in California and Washington. But in fact, we were actually supposed to go to Seattle for my birthday. Um, but then we canceled that last minute and we changed it to just being here. So while I didn't get to see any friends this year and it was just a, a family day of, of fun stuff here in Las Vegas, um, it was still very enjoyable and a really cool, extremely memorable birthday. So now you know what happened on my birthday yesterday, where we began the day with me not filming much, but uh, just opening some presents and eating some cake. But in the end, despite how unconventional and how unorthodox this birthday was, it was actually a lot of fun. So that's it, that's what happened on my birthday yesterday, all the way till the end of the day where we went to the strip and hung out and stuff. So hope you enjoyed this video, this quick birthday video this year. I tried to keep it a little bit more simple and I hope you enjoyed. So that's pretty much it for this video and uh, well, I'll see you guys in the next one. Tomorrow I'm filming another cool video that I'll be posting soon. Um, kind of like a, a follow-up video to one of my previous videos from like, I don't know, like a month ago or something. So I'm going to be filming that tomorrow. So I uh, look forward to that video and all of the videos in the future. And in fact, in two days from now, we are going to Washington State, where we will be going to our Seattle house for Christmas. So uh, look forward to those videos coming up in the future. Uh, more vlogs coming soon. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.